Hi YouTubers, this is Ingrid with Fearfully Made. Today I'm going to be doing another version of my tea time. This version is going to be of all my favorite teacups. And I have three teas that I'm going to share with you today that I did not share with you when I did my uh, tea, tea time video. So let's get right into it. Blueberry Slim Life. I bought this one, this is by Yogi, and I bought this at um, Walmart. And I also buy this sometimes at my health food store. So this one I use when I am, you know, exercising and trying to lose weight. This helps, it's green tea, blueberry slim life, and it says it energizes and supports a dieting program. Meaning when you're on a diet, you know, eating healthier, I don't like to say diet, but when you're eating healthier, it helps to support your immune system because it's, it's, it has blueberry and it helps with your metabolism as well. Also, this is another one that I did not talk about. I, I mentioned it, but I didn't say anything much about it. And this is pure air. Okay. And Dr. Oz used to talk a lot about this. This is similar to the oolong okay the oolong tea right there okay this is another one it's good for your metabolism it's good to when you're when you're on a diet you know to cut down on the fat intake that's what these teas does the pure hair okay the oolong and also the slim life and the slim life is a green tea okay but it's mixed in with blueberries. So you can you can check these out. I'm not going to go in depth with how they work and all that stuff, but you can check them out, okay? And I just want to share with you three snacks that I have usually when I'm doing my tea from the last time I have my Asian oil. I still have some of the, um, what is this, topper with the matcha. So I use that with my tea. And today I went to the health food store that I usually go to and I pick up um, this box of, it says Love Crunch and it's premium organic granola bars with dark chocolate maroon. So that's what it is. Okay, and they had this on sale. It was five and change and I got it for three, three ninety nine. And if these, this has coconut in it. And like I said before, I love coconut stuff. So I have this as a snack when I do my tea. And let me show you what it looks like. That's what it looks like. Okay. And um, it's very tasty because I had one earlier. I wanted to try it out. It was very good. And also, I have my Belvita. Usually, I buy this one. They have this at, I got this at Walmart, and they have it in mixed berry flavor and um chocolate and another another flavor I like the chocolate one so and it's 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 20 gram of whole grain and um it says four hours of nutritious steady energy okay and always make sure when i buy these things they don't have a lot of sugar because like i said i don't like a lot of sweet but I mean, everything you eat these days is it's either sweet or salt. So if I have something and it has a little bit too much sweet, then I have my tea, you know, that I drink and um, to go with it. Also, I want to share with you my cups. Now, when I did my Asian oil, I showed you this one that I had bought at the Asian market. Okay. And I've been enjoying it, you know, just putting the tea bag in and enjoy it so i'm sharing with you my teacups okay and these are just my dainties okay isn't that pretty very dainty okay i have had these for a while but that's that one is pink and a lot of flowers around the end of it this is another one with pink this one is by um sings sings or something like sings don't know who that is and then this one is the same it's got that floral definition 
I love that. It's so delicately. Look at that. It is so delicate looking. Mm, this is so nice. Okay, another pink and white and gray. Isn't that pretty? Okay. And then I have this one, which, you know, when you travel, you always buy a, a, a cup or a mug or something. Well, this mug, it says Caribbean, and then it have the map, okay, with um, Florida, the Bahamas, Jamaica, Haiti, you name it. So, um, and this has a little parrot on there. Isn't that pretty? So I have that one. And then I have... The containers that for this one, you could use milk. Some people like milk in their tea. I like my tea just regular. So this is very cute. Okay. And this one, you could put um, milk if you like milk in your tea. Also, I have here with me another one. This one, I had my mom passed away in... Um, 2005 and she used to use this one when she comes to visit from Jamaica and I kept this one so this one was given to me by someone and um, a client of mine and so I kept it and she used to drink out of this one too I love this cup isn't it pretty look at that one so these are just some of my favorite teacups um, that I want to share with you and this one I love this. This is a crystal. And this is what I drink out of almost every night. When I feel like I want to jazz it up a little bit, I use this one because I, you know, I recently bought that one. But this one is my favorite. I use this crystal for everything. It's got a lot of flowers engraved on it. That's all that is. I don't know if you can see it, but it's very pretty. And that's my crystal one. And also, in addition to my cups, I have these little pitcher because sometimes when you make your tea, if you're a tea lover and you love hot tea, then you can, if you, you want and you're tired of having your tea warm or hot, you could put your tea in a little pitcher. Isn't that cute? This is a small one. And um, I... Um, we we'll just put ice in it and then make it into an iced tea with a little twist of lemon and a little bit of honey. If you have um, anything like this and it's crystal-like, don't put hot water in it, okay? Because it will crack. So this is it. Isn't that cute? So that's just a small size, just enough for two or three people. So if you like milk, you can use this also as another pitcher. So, um, and then I have this for my, you know, sugar. You put that in, you put your sugar in here and it's got the little opening to go around the spoon and that's it right there. Isn't that cute? And last, well, not last, before I go to the last one, I have this one. Oh, this is so cute. This this is hand painted and it says at the back made in Western Germany and it says love story hand painted. My hubby gave me this one. So this one is kind of like a little antique. I love it because it's so pretty. Let me bring it close so you can see it. Isn't that pretty? Yes. So, uh, very dainty thing. So I just wanted to share these with you. Another tea time version, not just the tea, but my cups that I use for my tea. And this one says New York. This one is a man's cup. No, this is for my hubby. I bought this for my hubby when I went to New York. And, um, you know, when you go and you are um, in the airport area, they have the little um boutique shops in inside there so i bought this one for him he hardly use it because he hardly drink tea so i'm using this today all right so cheers to you guys thank you guys for watching my 
tea time version of all my utensils and all my cups that I use for my tea, all my dainties. And you let me know which one is your favorite one. <laughs> and um, also, don't forget, you can use your pitchers as well if you want to have your tea cold um, for those summer long hot days. Don't forget, if you like this video, to give it a thumbs up and to comment and to subscribe. Thank you very much for joining me in my tea time. And I hope that you like it. And let me know which one of the, the cup you like. Okay, give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. Thank you, guys. Bye-bye.